How's it going everybody? Your boy John is back, but this time instead of shiny hunting on one game, we're shiny hunting on two. We are going to be doing Pokemon Scarlet and Violet. No, I'm kidding. We're doing Pokemon Violet and we are going to be playing Pokemon... I think this is the shield copy. Oh, you know what? I actually think it is the opposite. I think this is my sword copy. So, the hunts today, I've been kind of weighing things out. Glaceon seems to be what I'm going to be hunting right now because I know everybody would like destroy me if I didn't do this because it's a uh, it's Glaceon right and I don't know how resets are going to go how many we're going to get in a certain amount of time but I'm going to try doing resets in Pokemon Sword and see what I can do but if it's too much to handle, I might just drop it and then for next stream we're gonna pick up and just do like Pokemon Let's Go. Yo, what's up coffee? Yo, the bone original dozer, what's up? The John Gordon man, hey dude, I have made it to the stream. I'm doing good, I'm doing good. I was just really busy the last couple days, so I couldn't unfortunately make it to a stream on time. But I also didn't expect to run into some technical difficulties right before I wanted to stream. I should have known better, but how is the layout for everybody? Is the layout okay? Is Can you see everything? Can you see two switches? Can you see, <laughs> can you see everything good or audio is good? Because this is like a brand new layout, right? So we got to make sure everything's up and running. I'm maybe going to play around with my webcam a bit. But that's that's literally the only thing I could say that is going to change. Still the annoying TikTok. Yeah, I know. I, I wish I wasn't a John talker either. But the views are pretty good, bro. The views are pretty good. You're here with your old Antonio. What's up? What's up? I think this is going to be really cool doing the two switches again at once. The thing is, is that resets don't take that much effort. Like I got new joy cons, so I'm rocking that again. It's just trying to, I guess, once you get your outbreak. Oh, you know what? I need a sandwich. I've already failed the stream. Once we get our outbreak and we can knock out all 60 mons, then it just becomes easy, right? But until then, I'm trying to like micromanage in my head so I'm not wasting time, the resets, so we're not, you know, having dead time in there. But I'm telling you now, I need a new controller. I'm thinking about getting one, like an actual pro controller. If you go on Amazon, okay, so these Joy-Cons, I swear to you not. They are literally the exact same. You could tell the plastic is quite close to the original uh, comparing the, the Joy-Cons to the Nintendo brand. They work perfectly. They're so good and they're 40 bucks Canadian. Just drawing Lapras in a sobble swimming on the ocean for my girlfriend. Oh yeah, nice. I, I think I saw that message in the chat. Hope she likes it because she loves Lapras. I love Lapras too. I really love Lapras. Oh, we don't have enough monies. We don't have enough monies. I guess we gotta go make some monies. You're tired? I, pff, buddy, I had a nap earlier. <laughs> I needed that nap. Oh, it was so good though, because now I can stream for a few hours. I will give it a go for a couple hours, see what we can get. But the thing that I'm gonna need to figure out is the lighting situation. The lighting situation is the next thing on my uh, tasks for the, the YouTube. But yeah, see, this is what happens when you run two games at once. I'm, I'm getting like all confused and stuff. <laughs> And unfortunately, when it comes to the to the stream, I'm going to still have to make, technically they're called scenes, but 
I'm going to have to make like an actual layout for if we get a shiny Pokemon and we want to we want to get a better look at it with a, a larger screen. I'm going to have to transition to another scene. 24 hour stream. Kevin just did one of those. I, I, I went to a stream like four times over the last 24 hours. It was funny. I, I went to work today. Ken was, uh, he was still streaming because he was going from yesterday, right? <laughs> and then what not? I'm coming back home from work and the guy's still going. Should I post it on the Discord to get your opinion on the drawing? Yeah, just put it in our art channel. We have an art channel. Yeah, you're more than welcome to try that. Yeah. But how's the, how's the screen? How are the screens? Can you guys see everything perfect or what? How is the frame rate? That's one thing that I'm, uh, that I'd like to know. Okay, one. I, I'm just gonna make one sandwich here and then we should be able to, to go off the one for now. You know I'd be super hype? A Verizian. <laughs> but yeah, also, thank you. We are still doing above average for the YouTube right now. Uh, I got literally over 20 subscribers my last video. You never know how the algorithm is like gonna, gonna favor um, things and we're, we're doing really well. We're on track to like keep succeeding. Everything's up with the analytics. I'm like super happy. And when we can, you know, afford to do other things, I can afford to spend money like with YouTube and get the option to have two switches going at once now. So that's sick. But I'm gonna, I'm gonna have another video. So my, <laughs> <laughs> Those TikTok mobile effect videos, they are doing well, so I think I'm going to keep them going. But the thing is, make a bitter sandwich? I don't know what that is. Um, I'm going to keep those going, but I'm going to I'm gonna offer everybody kind of a little bit of a, a creative choice with the direction I take them in. If they like the blind drinking or... They want me to try something new. I'm, I'm willing to open up and uh, get some feedback on some mobile effect videos you have seen maybe on YouTube or TikTok. The one thing I'll also not be able to do is keep track of how many encounters we do. So this is just gonna be a uh, I know there's an auto tracker you can get where every reset you can you can literally have like a I don't know like a counter go off literally what it's called <laughs> but I don't know how to get that how to turn it on so when it comes to Verizian when you see something pink <laughs> we won't have a number to classify it as but yeah, if you want to go see an awesome start to a Lapras drawing, uh, go to the Discord. For sure. This is cool. The next thing I'm investing in, the microphone works fine, but I want one of those claw ones. I think that'd be really cool for the, for the setup. My next investment is a webcam. It's a webcam. It's going to be, I'm going to get a better one because this one is like on its last life. <laughs> okay, so let's go back to Glaceon. You put it in the general server. I mean, that's okay. That's fine. Ooh, when it gets like super, super dark with the two screens like that, the lighting looks bad. Um, I, I can't, unfortunately when you have two things going at once, that's the one thing I won't be able to do now is like, kind of look back and forth between Discord and stuff, but I'll, I'll definitely check it out when, um, stream's done. 
I'm trying to max, I, I just like when I do these, I want to maximize time so everybody on screen, or yeah, everybody on the stream itself, they're not like waiting around to see me play, right? Yeah, but I'll definitely check it out afterwards. And I knew if I didn't do Glaceon, I would have been roasted. So, <laughs> we're doing Glaceon. Does anybody... Is this just like a darker shiny? Is it a darker shiny? Hey, Lightning, how's it going? What's up? I, I know, I know what it is, like I, I have it in Pokemon Go, but I just, uh, I can't remember off the top of my head what I'm looking for in this game. Yeah, nobody can roast me yet. Don't worry, you'll, you'll find a way. <laughs> you'll find a way to roast me. Um, maybe I should look, I, I can't look it up. I, that's one other thing I couldn't fit on the screen is <laughs> is unfortunately we had like a current hunt. Not that most people paid attention to it anyways, but we used to have like a current hunt animation. I I had fortunately had to get rid of that for the space because two screens take up a lot. They take up a lot, but. I don't know, do you, to people in the chat right now, do you prefer seeing two Switches going at once? So you have two different games? Or do you just prefer the one? Is two, like, too overwhelming, or? For me, it's just managing all the games so that I'm not wasting time. We used to do it. Uh, probably like a year and a half ago. The last time I would have done a double hunt, I think I was double hunting uh, Arceus. Arceus and BDSP. I'd still love to do that one day, but I, I don't know how, but when I was traveling in Europe, when my suitcase broke, I, I believe I, it must have been in the lining of the suit because it's a black cartridge. I think I lost it when my suitcase broke and I was transitioning to another one. And then I really didn't like the game other than Arceus and Shaman. And I said, if I want it again, I'll buy it again down the road. Because they had a deal at GameStop where I could trade in some games. So I did that. We'll do Shaman. We did Darkrai. And we'll have to do uh Arceus one day I'll have to see if somebody will let me borrow their copies or I'll like I said I'll just go buy them because they're super cheap but is there anybody new in the chat anybody new have you found us through the the shorts page have you found us through our uh our mobile videos the Glaceons are running at me I don't like it ew the old guy ugh the the young James, uh oh, God. I told you I was gonna stream. I just ran out of time when I was trying to diagnose everything with the stream last time. And then I didn't realize, I thought Joy-Cons, maybe the one difference I'll say is the Joy-Cons, my new ones that are like the knockoff brand, they don't charge as fast as the the brand ones. So when I got everything going, they were on charge for a bit, but then I had to take them off the, the switch because that's how they charge, right? They didn't have enough time to charge. So me having two, uh, two screens going at the same time wouldn't have been possible. So that's why we switch. Ashton, what's up? Hey, hey. What do you think is gonna shine first? I know it's a, a really silly question, but the way my luck's been going in different games, I, I honestly don't know. Are we gonna get the Verizian first? Or are we gonna get Glaceon? 
See, if I was watching a stream, I think this would be like really cool because you get to you get to interact with a streamer and they're playing two games at once. Like that's sick. I I love the concept. It would definitely be easier, I'll tell you this now, if we were playing Let's Go. Because we could literally just have the game going in the background. We don't even have to touch the controller. We could just look over. We could just look over, fly above the spot. My, my one thought was, and tell me everybody that's watching now if it's a dumb idea. But should we do what I wanted to do before and go back to Let's Go and get a legitimate shiny uh like living decks in that game so i think the only thing you can't get in that game would be mew i think you can get everything else i would be willing to go and do that i'd be willing to go and do that i did you should we we played and i got a lot of shinies don't get me wrong i was probably missing like 20 or 30 but Oh man, <laughs> I'm uh, I, I I just how do I say it? I think I forget what game came out. Was it Sword and Shield that came out after Let's Go? I think it was, and I just switched to it. But I'd love to go back, and I want to restart from the beginning. So we're gonna we're gonna get like Bulbasaur. We're gonna get another Bulbasaur. <laughs> We're gonna get Pidgeys. We're gonna. We're literally gonna do the whole shiny living decks over again. Cause think about this too. We have over a year until our next Pokemon game, so we've got to find creative ways to keep the stream going and fun, right? And I think two, two copies of Pokemon games are gonna be great, but we need to, we need to find some fun so nobody's bored, right? What's your favorite evolution? We were talking about this last stream. Um, I would say shiny wise, it would have to be Espeon, but I think um, Pokemon wise, it's gonna be Umbreon, non-shiny. But is there the one other concept? So I'm gonna have to follow up with the my 3DS guy who does my uh, who did my capture card. He he read my first message, but then didn't follow back up with me. It's unfortunately broken right now. I don't know what happened to it. I, I, I really don't. Uh, the the connection for the, the USB just, I don't know. It's like, it was breaking every time I put it in. So I'm going to have to follow up with him. But eventually I want to start doing crystal hunts. And if I can get an older capture card with a Game Boy, I want to go back to like Pokemon Emerald and do like full, full odds hunts. I think that'd be cool. Espeon is a really good shiny. It is a really good shiny. But I think Espeon myself, it, it, it is the best shiny of all the evolutions. Umbreon is good shiny, but it's, you know what I mean? It's not like the best. It's not the best. But, wait. Is that the shiny that, is that it? Whoa! Oh, I thought it was. It, it was so darker. What? That's sick. That is so sick. Whoa, look at that. All right, that was super easy. <laughs> that was super easy. Nice. All right, let's try catching it. One, two, oof. Maybe I should have done the quick ball. <laughs> it is just a subtle, subtle difference. Dive ball? Yeah, I can try. One. Oof. I'll try dive ball. That's sick, though. Alright. Dive ball request. Here we go. 
Boom. One, two, three. Oh, three shake fake. Come on. <laughs> All right, let's try one more time. That worked. Oh, no, that didn't work at all. <clears throat> hey, it was a good shot. It was a good shot. Okay, um, too late for a quick ball. So we'll just go back to our, our ultras. <laughs> That's so cool. We got, oh, critical. <clears throat> we got it like right off the bat, man. So anybody that is just tuning in now, we have just caught a shiny Glaceon in an outbreak. So that's what it looks like. That is so cool, man. That is sick. All right, um, so now that we've done that, what is our next hunt, everybody? What's gonna be our next hunt? I don't know, I don't know. What what could we do? I guess that's the question. What do we got for outbreaks? What do we got? Um, Vibrava, no. Dugong, eh, Dugong's not great. Scissor, I've already done. It's crazy because I love resetting in Pokemon uh, Sword and Shield. But I think shiny wise, shinies in this game are really cool in Scarlet and Violet. But when we get a shiny Virizion, I feel like it's almost as good as like four shinies of this game, you know? Desbugin, hey, how's it going? Hopefully I didn't butcher your name. <laughs> how's it going, bro? Um, nothing up here. I don't have a shiny of that little fish thing, but that area sucks to, to play. It really does. Timber, that mouse, I don't have that mouse either. And we've already gotten two new subscribers. So if you're new and you subscribe, thanks a lot. That is awesome. I really appreciate that. Tet pig, we've just done recently. Sawsbuck we've just done recently. Froki we've just done recently. Oh, see, I get confused sometimes with my controllers. See, mm, Casaroya Lake. Let me check this out here. Because I don't have this Pokemon, I would really like it. One was me? Well, thank you so much. <laughs> I hope everybody is gonna have a really solid time because I'm telling you now, <laughs> if you ever wanna become a streamer, dude, just have two streams going at once, or two streams, uh, have two games going at once and you'll have my vote. Uh, I'll come watch you. My Lee, hey, is there any Scarlet and Violet Pokemon starter fans? I'm a fan of them. I, I like them. I wouldn't say they're my the worst generation either. I, I like a lot of them. All right, now here's the predicament. Because of lag lake here, it's slowing down a bit on stream. Um, do you think, again, everybody here that's currently watching the stream, let me know, is this shiny worth our time? Should we hunt this or no? I don't even know what it looks like, but should we shiny hunt this or no? Should we move on to something else? Dog day, what's up man? I'm John, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. More of a gen six starter fan. I'm gonna get roasted because my favorite generation is gen one. And I think that's the best one. But if I were to say a second best generation, I would probably go with Gen 6. Yeah, Gen 6. So I'll, I'll give everybody a little 
one to two seconds here. Oh, time's up. I'm kidding. I don't see any comments saying you guys don't want to go for this. So we could go for it. But I just, I feel like it's, I hate the lagginess of this lake. It makes things look bad. So you know what? I've, I've confirmed it. We're going to reset and we're going to continue. We're going to try something else. And thank you for the two likes. Um, I, I'm grateful. Thank you. There was two like hype. We're going to get, we're going to get a shiny Verizian today. Um, ooh, it's, I don't have that shiny. That Swallout, I think that's what it's called. I don't think I have that. We just did Axie or else that would be really cool too. Flabebe, I just, uh, I just got one in Pokemon Go today. And I got that costume Cottony, which is super sick. Super cool. Uh, Ralts? No, we don't want that. Can you blow up your stove or washing machine? I mean, I can. Do I want to? Yes, but just not right now. <laughs> I can't confirm when I'm going to do it, but maybe I will one, one of these days. Oops. Okay, we're going to reset. So we want to see, uh, I guess people are calling it salmon, but I'm calling it pink. We want to see a pink deer, pink Verizian. We're going to make elk burgers. <laughs> okay, we've just done Grimer. Uh, Rotom, we have done. Litten, we've done. Whoa, there's a happy, a happy Ambi in the chat, guys. Oh, so this is a perfect time for me to talk to, to Happy again. So everybody was saying last stream, I don't know if you were there the whole time, but it came up in conversation and I said I would talk to you about it, but we've got to do another shiny race. We've got to continue the series. Uh, Lampin, wow, we're not getting like really good outbreaks here. I think this is a hot take, but I love Chikorita. I think it's the best Gen 2 starter. Okay, I'm gonna, I think it's really good. I'm going to agree with you on that. That is my favorite Gen 2 starter as well. But is the is the term hot take like a new younger thing that's like going around? Because I'm hearing that in podcasts all the time when I'm at work. Yo, what's the hot take? Give us your hot take. I, I'm hearing it constantly now and it's gotta be something new, right? Yeah, we got a happy. We got a happy in the chat. Oh, he's even down to continue it. Ooh. You know what's cool though? We we made the rules the first time. So I think happy should make the rules for the next one. Is that fair? I think hot take would be like the unpopular opinion. But but here's the thing. That term is nothing like I haven't heard that over the years. Like, if there was something, like, super juicy or gossipy that went down, yeah, somebody might say that, right? But I'm hearing that specific term go crazy right now over podcasts and stuff. <gasps> Umbreon! No way we get an Umbreon outbreak? Did this just turn into, like, us getting evolutions today? It's something people will not agree with. Really? Huh, that's the that's the unpopular opinion. Before, give us the hot take. To me, that would have meant when I heard it, like give us like the juicy gossip or the, spill the hot tea. That's what I, I, I've been trying to get on that term too. People were saying spill the tea. I'm like, that's the dumbest way to say, tell me something cool. <laughs> Oh, Sableye. When I see Sableye in, in Pokemon Go, I'm really trying to catch up with like Mega Battles because I really thought Mega Battles were, they were cool at first, but I didn't really, I wasn't for them, right? 
But I'm trying to catch up, and I love seeing Mega Pokemon now. What in the world am I hearing? My take on Mega Battles and Pokemon. This and that. YOLO. Okay, Umbreon Outbreak, where are you? Let me guess, it's not daytime. Oh, it was daytime. Was it daytime and that's why we can't get it? Oh, this, this game frustrates me. My Ungreon Funko Pop just came in. Ooh, you have all the Funkos. I do not own a single Funko. I know what they are. Oh, can I leave? I know what they are. I've never owned one. When I get a better webcam, the, the webcam is going to show a lot more detail and a little bit more depth of field to the back of my, my, my background. And when I solidify like an actual webcam position, I'm gonna, I'm gonna have something like really cool. I'm gonna start collecting collectibles and y'all are gonna see them on the, the back there. My Ungreon Funko Pop just... Oh, no, I read that. Nice. I'm caught up. For EX, I thought Gen 5 is trash. Gen 5 is a lot of simps because of... Completion Pokemon and animated sprites along with it being people's first game. Such person would say that's my hot take on it. Really? I mean, I kind of agree. A lot of people love Gen 5 and I'm not the biggest fan. But... Yeah, whatever, you know, like, eh, it's just perspectives at the end of the day, right? It's a good one, though. Also, news about Godzilla. Ooh, I haven't watched it. I haven't watched it. I wish they did Pokemon uh, Chase Funky and them to be shiny they missed out. I don't know what that is. I just completed my Pokemon. Oh, Moon Nuzlocke today. How long did it take you? was level 76 first shiny Drapion, and I used him to sweep the professor's entire team. That's, that's pretty cool. I'd love to do like one of those one day. But question for anybody in the chat that knows, but can you advance time in this game? Because right now it's daylight and we need night time. Can you go back to the the third area there? Um, Kitakami, not Kitakami, uh, I don't know, why am I blanking on this right now? The Blueberry Academy and advance the time. It's a different variant? Interesting. I'm sort of multitasking at the moment, so I'm gonna be quiet. Yeah, no problem, man. Faux show. Because if you can't advance in the game, it's gonna suck, we can't do Umbreon. We won't be able to do Umbreon. Zebstrika. Multitasking in this game is fun. Godzilla coming out on the 29th. So does it come out this Friday? Uh, we could do Honchkrow. I think I already have a Honchkrow, but you know what, let's just do it, YOLO. I just, I don't know how to advance day. If we can get a nighttime vibe going on here soon, I'll, I'll go back to Umbreon. But for now, we'll just stick with Honchkrow. But wait, Honchkrow is probably a nighttime too, no? It's probably gonna be a nighttime shiny, t or a nighttime Pokemon. It took me a few years because I lost my game for a few years and I recently found and completed it. That's, hey, you know what? It, you figured it out, you you got it, you picked it back up and you completed it. That's the best you can do, right? Okay, it's not nighttime. I don't think it'll be nighttime soon. So we're gonna have to unfortunately skip the outbreak. I myself am looking very forward to playing Pokemon Crystal. Chem really inspired me to go back and play like over the year, I'd say over the last two years, I'll throw on my Pokemon Crystal copy or I'll throw on Pokemon Ultra Moon and I'll do 
like Dynamax or not Dynamax Adventures. I'll do the uh, the Ultra Wormholes, and I'll try to get a shiny. But when I saw Ken doing the eggs, and I I researched what he was saying with the shiny Gyarados that you get for free, a part of the story in Gen Two. You literally can get odds of one in sixty four if it can breed with other Pokemon. If it can't breed with other Pokemon and you do that shiny family kind of uh, grouping, you can create a shiny Pokemon, a shiny parent. Oh, Tauros, nice. And you can do it that way, but man, I'm, uh, I'm hatching Dratini right now in Gen 2. It takes forever, but I think it's going to look really cool. A Dragonite. What should you shiny hunt in Pokemon Moon? Um, I don't even know. Off the top of my head, that's a lot of pressure. We've wasted a whole sandwich just trying to figure out what we want to hunt. I'm gonna have to get more more points. Okay, Sudowoodo, we've we've gotten that. We've got that little baby. Uh, Rockruff, we've already got. We've got Spoink. We've already got that. Uh oh, I uh I don't have. That belly knockoff Chansey. We should do that. Hey Val, how's it going? Hey, hey, hey. I feel like Grubbin would be cool. Yeah, Grubbin's a really good one. It's a good shiny. But we have five minutes left on a sandwich. What does what does this belly Pokemon even look like? I'm trying to get uh, a, a rhythm going down. <laughs> it's not working. Oh, this is another laggy area. Oof. Whoa, you found a mass outbreak of Belly Bolt. What does this shiny look like? I don't even know. Belly Bolt? We'll just call him Belly. I usually don't nickname Pokemon, but I would just name this one Belly. That's what they should have done. Not have come up with a creative name, just call it Belly. It turns yellow, so it's a good shiny then. That's a complete different, uh, that's a complete difference, right? Should just call it Belly Chansey. <laughs> uh. Oh, you know what I took as like good news? My last video for the, the mobile effects that we do. So if there's anybody that's new here, we do those like, they're TikTok filters, but I upload them to YouTube Shorts. I get roasted most of the time for my choices because people think blind ranking is easy, but it really isn't, right? So, <laughs> This last video, I didn't get blasted for anything, so I guess it was a it was a good uh, a good break for everybody, right? Hey, yeah, I'm a you talker exactly. YouTube and I don't see. Here's the thing, I only have TikTok for uh, videos like that, right? YouTube Shorts are the same thing as TikTok. Everything gets uploaded by every other social media person to both platforms. So to be honest, you really don't need both. Even if you were just like a social media connoisseur, you don't need both. Did you know you could catch Ultra Beasts in the end game of Pokemon Moon? Uh, I didn't, no. I didn't know that. See, Ultra Moon, I really enjoyed it, but the first time around I didn't play it properly. 
I played Pokemon Moon. I think I beat it. It was so long ago, I can't recall. But, oh, it's, uh, it was one of those games that was hard not to play. And I'm pretty sure we did Ultra Moon on stream. I'm, I'm pretty sure. Any of the OGs out there would know. Oh, bye-bye, Gold Duck. <laughs> Sorry, bud. I hope we get a Verizian. That'd be really cool. And it's not even blowing up my computer, too. Having uh, two, two video sources at once. When I was trying to stream YouTube Shorts, uh, like, live and the horizontal perspective... It was blowing up my computer like crazy. It was gonna self-destruct. I have a simple Mac too, right? Nothing crazy. I don't remember my Ultra Sun playthrough much besides finding shinies after beating it. I would, we did a route challenge. I got the, I got all the, the Pokemon that I needed to get the shiny charm in that game. And when I got the shiny charm, I did a route challenge, which I never finished. And I think we got up to like seven shinies and I, I kind of stopped. I don't know why. I, I honestly don't know why. It could, it could have been many reasons, but I really want to start doing challenges again. We were doing them for like two months and it was really fun, but it would require my 3DS capture card, right? I don't play emulated copies because I don't see the sense in getting shinies through emulated copies if you can't keep them. I don't I don't believe in that, at least. Um, emulated copies are really easy to play a game that you don't have. But for me, I like... Don't get me wrong, in like 30 years, shinies are going to be probably irrelevant to me. Wink. Kidding. No, we're going to love them. But... I, I like to have them on my physical cartridge. There was a time where you always got hacked shinies. Um, to be honest, I never have ever gotten a hacked shiny, but back with Sword and Shield, when I first, here's like a John origin story, but when I got my capture card, my first capture card, my goal was, because I, I didn't know I wanted to become like a, a, a streamer per se, but I would upload my videos um, at the start of um, Sword and Shield and I would get a lot of views for my egg hatches and I would just record them, upload them, and it, it was doing really well. And then that's how I went into streaming. But when I got into the streaming, I was doing those um, Dynamax Adventure Dens not, I guess, sorry. We were doing the raid dens. And I would do that whole doo-doo bot. Find the, find the seed. And with the seed, I would host shiny dens for people. And I got a lot of views then. But I, I again, I really never got shinies myself through them. Because I was always hosting, right? So we've given out a lot of shinies. But... I found out like just later after doing all of them, I didn't really feel, I didn't feel accomplished. My argument was if I were to get shinies that way, it would just save time rather than hunting, right? But shinies, the fun of it is the hunt. So any, any Dynamax adventures I kept, but any raid dens were maybe I got like one or two through the exploit like that, I deleted. Because I didn't think in my own perspective of how I wanted my shinies and everything, it didn't meet the criteria anymore. What's up, Val? Hey. Origin John. <laughs> it's an uglier version of this one right here that you're looking at now. <laughs> it's a baby version. It's a baby mythical. What shiny are you going for? Um, right now we're doing the, the belly bolt. 
and I'm doing Verizian. So we're doing two hunts at once. And I think I'm nailing it so far. <laughs> we're not we're not wasting time, which is really good. We're not wasting a lot of time in between the counters. But like I said, I can't determine what number I'm at with uh, Verizian. I've got my I've got my two controllers right now perfectly in hand, so I know what I'm doing. But if I lose the if I lose the vibe, and let's just say I, I had a counter where I had to, or I had to like manually do it, oh, that'd be so hard. They're apparently the belly ball. I never knew what this shiny looked like, and it's an outbreak. So I'm like, yeah, let's try it, right? But I've never, I've never gotten a Verizian yet shiny, just in Pokemon Go. So these are two apparently good shinies. Well, okay, one I already know is good, the Verizian. I already know what that is, but the Bell Bolt. Um, I'm. Going off your word there, and I'm gonna I'm gonna trust y'all and say it's a, they're both good shinies based off that. Is anybody else shiny hunting right now, or are you just watching, chilling before bed? Because I know it's like almost 8 p.m. I feel like we're gonna get a gold duck. There's a lot of gold ducks here, and no belly bolts. You're shiny hunting in Violet. Is anybody doing any cool hunts or are you kind of just doing things to complete the decks? Me for, so we got grubbing going on right now. We got herba farming going, you know what I'm hunting. Um, so when it comes to the schedule going forward for the week, one thing I didn't realize is Easter weekend is this weekend. <laughs> holidays to me I always forget I always forget until they show up I'm probably good for a couple streams this weekend to be honest I could probably do that right hey you're just watching in the background oh awesome nice I I'm whenever I watch streams that is 98% of what I do I'm just switching dates to see what I get. Sometimes that's really fun, but it takes you like 30 minutes just to get through <laughs> until you get something you want. I haven't even been checking the messages. Oh. You know what? I'm going to save anyways, just in case. Oh man, but yeah, I need to do some herba farming and then me and Happy are gonna have to figure out some details and try to get a, a stream going for next month or whenever he can. Cause last time we gave everybody like a week's notice. There are not many belly bolt left from the original outbreak. Okay, so that is, that's the last message. Okay, so. That was the last message. Okay, three. Four. I'm, I don't know if I have time tonight to edit a video for uh, the mobile effects. Or you know what, I think I can do one. I think I can upload that, but I was gonna switch it up and do something different. That was the plan, but I, I just don't know if I have enough time for that. But I think, I, I don't remember. Was my last one the the Kalos region one? Because if it was, I can do the, I can do the Ultra Moon. I can do the Alola version. And I'll upload that tonight. 
for everybody. So then you can watch it in the morning or right before you go to bed, depending on when you go. But the good thing about uploading at night is it's kind of like a sweet spot. If you upload around seven, it's like right after dinner, people are lounging, they're chilling. And then people watch going to bed and then you get that like reverse daytime. So people, it's their day across the world and they wake up to see the video. Oh, it's, it's just really good. I'm finding the right time to edit and upload things. Okay, so that's it. That's it. We're gonna go to, we're gonna go back to the Blueberry Academy and we're gonna have to do some, we're gonna have to do some BP cause I ran out. You found an Oricorio outbreak. That's, um, I think I've done that once before. We did Oricorio in Ultra Moon for the route challenge. That's one I'm very aware of that we've done before. I really like uh, some of the shinies. And we, actually we've done an Oricorio, the, the blue one in, um, in Kitakami. We've done that. Okay. What are you, what are you, what are you doing? Ah, what happened? I didn't miss any shinies. Nice try, ha ha. What's a bitter sandwich? Oh, it's like a herb one, right? If that, yeah, what? Change for 50 BP? I don't even have that. <laughs> you have a shiny Lunala. I, I, that was like one of my first hunts that I did with uh, Dynamax Adventures. I loved it. I loved Soul Galeo. So, I'm very much against when people, okay, how do I say this without offending? So, I'm very much against clickbaiting content because there's a lot of people that say world's first shiny venonat right and this and that but i was the first person to upload shiny footage that was of a solgaleo that was the first time huntable in sword and shield right when it came to the dynamax adventures that video blew up overnight because i remember i went to go see a a girl i was dating at the time the next day and i stayed up way too late to hunt that when it first came out and <laughs> I, I i never i did i don't do clickbait crap like that but i was so pumped because that was like one of my first hunts that i did that i remember on that game okay we got to sneak up on a pokemon I need the shiny hunt more legends and sword. Wouldn't that be cool? <laughs> I was doing those shorts for a while that were like, can I get a shiny Tapu Bulu in four raids? I was doing those and I got it surprisingly quicker than I thought I would. So we did get the Tapu Bulu recently, but I was thinking about doing the Dynamax adventures, which would have probably been easier to do than, than resets. Because you're, you're not pressing as many buttons, but everybody was saying that they really wanted to see, um, like, a reset hunt. Uh, we'll, we'll eventually go back to it, for sure. I'm, I'm not going to definitely write that off. It's just one of those things where you kind of have to... You kind of have to be in the mood for the content. And right now, the, the shorts feed has been loving the Pokemon Go content and those mobile videos. So this week, I know for sure I've got two videos that are gonna come out. One's about my primal Groudon day. I did like 18 raids and recorded 18 of them. So you're gonna see like a montage of that. I've got my shiny Cottony highlight. I just, I, I gotta start bringing a web or a webcam. <laughs> 
I gotta start bringing a camera with me so y'all can see my reaction. You're gonna get off so I can sleep? All right, yeah, have fun. We'll, we'll see you on the next stream. We'll see you on the next one. Thanks for hanging out. All right, let's switch this one. Make, oh, okay, that's great. Make a sandwich with three ingredients. That's easy. That we can do no problem. You know what? Oh, my arms get so stiff by just having them locked in like that. Oh. Okay, little break. Little John break. <laughs> Ooh. I love Diet Pepsi. Okay. Tomato, pickle, green bell pepper. Sure, add four mayonnaise. Oh, okay. I'm, uh, I'm, I'm, I didn't even share this story yet, but I was a little disappointed. I was at my dad's uh, yesterday and I, to go to Madrid for the Pokemon Go event for the Go Fest, I was like really pumped about. And you know what happened? It was like $600. It was super cheap for round trip tickets and I should have bought them then, but I waited. And now they're like double the price. It's like $1,200 to go there now. It's crazy. I'm still gonna go, I'm still gonna pay the money, but I'm like a little salty about it, to be honest. It makes me not want to go, but I just have to fly somewhere else that's gonna be cheaper and then fly to Madrid. So I'm still gonna go, but it's kind of annoying it's kind of annoying that in less than a week's time it went up like that, but it's just, I, I just don't get why. It wasn't the Pokemon Go news, because of the Pokemon Go news, I would have definitely, uh, how do I say it? It would have definitely spiked on the day of the announcement, but it never did. Me and my rusted fork are hurt by that price. Yeah, I mean, the thing is, is that I can still budget my trip and make it affordable. <laughs> I know it sounds weird, but I might, I might just go, my, my plan is right now, I'm going to go to Copenhagen. I'm going to fly there, visit some friends that I met on my last Europe trip. And then I'm going to fly to Madrid for the weekend. And then I'm gonna go to Portugal. I wanted to go to Germany as well, but I just, I don't think I'll have the time. Plus to go to Germany is another $200. So I think I'm just gonna visit two cities and then just do my beach trip in Portugal. But <laughs> I really, I bought my ticket to Madrid. I could literally just say, nah, I'm not gonna go, go to New York. I could do that and I'm saving so much money, but I don't, I, I honestly don't know what I'm gonna do. I need to get a job soon, but everywhere I look, they say you need to be 18. Uh, to be honest, younger people face a lot of discrimination when it comes to jobs because when you get to be even my age, like I'm 30, it's, they want people with job experience, which again, it's like very discriminatory to people that are trying to get a job in the first place because you want that experience. But it's also development of the brain. I know it sounds weird to say it like that, but more mature you are, which only comes with age, the better results you get when it comes to the hiring process. So I totally get how that kind of sucks. But, oh, believe me, I wish I could, wish I could help everybody get a job. You know what's funny too? Um, I know there's probably a lot of Mr. Beast fans here. My buddy sent me a link today 
And a, a city that's an hour and a half away from here um, has an ad on Indeed. And the ad literally says, like, and it's official, Mr. Beast is hiring a videographer. <laughs> He's hiring a videographer. And in my area, like, it's close to Toronto, but not in Toronto. So it's kind of like, why? I thought I would just apply for the jokes and see see what would happen because that's that's my field, right? I'm like really into photography, videography, editing. I can do all of that and probably be better than 90% of what he hires. But like, I just thought it was funny. Mr. Beast is looking for somebody over in my area. I'm sure he pays a lot. I'm sure he pays a lot. Like when I was looking it up, apparently the median salary is 67,000 for a videographer that he pays. And I know like there's a lot of incentives with working with him. Like on the ad, it literally says you need to be able to be flexible in travel. Unless he's paying for that, I don't see why other people would want to travel if they're that's not coming out of some sort of travel expense. But I can see it being fun to work for somebody like uh, Mr. Beast. I've heard some things that are like negative about him, but I don't see it being negative in my own opinion. I just see Mr. Beast as a person who likes, who is a leader and takes control of things. But I heard he could be a little arrogant. I don't know. I don't know. That's what I was looking up on reviews. I have nothing bad to say about the guy. The guy does a lot of good for the world. Him and his channel. Him and his crew. So it'd be funny. I'll I'll apply for the memes. <laughs> and it, I mean, it, wouldn't that be funny if it happened? <laughs> oh, wouldn't that be funny? All right, come on, Bella Bolt. Nope. And you guys said it's yellow, right? I feel like this game is confused right now because there's way too many gold duck. There's literally no, there's not a lot of Bella Bolts here. Yeah, I'm, I'm sure the shiny is gonna look really good, but the problem is, is that there's way too many gold duck here. There's way too many. It's like they're taking most of the outbreak spawns away from me. I feel like I gotta still find a way to to add current hunt. Um, actually, I think I know a way I can add it in. I think I know a way I can add it in. So then everybody knows what we're hunting without, you know, having to guess. Because, like, right now it's Verizian, but with a stream title, it's too long to add, like, both the Pokemon names. So, <laughs> you got to come up with those creative titles, right? Part of the job. Part of the job. The vibration, I'll say though, I don't know if you can hear it on the, the, the microphone there. It's, it's a little louder than the normal brand. No Oricorio yet. Uh, no Bella Bowl for me, yo. We got Glaceon pretty quick. I was super happy about that. I, I, I know I have to have a Glaceon, but I was thinking about it and I honestly don't know. I think that might have been my first one. I think that literally might have been my first one.
I'm not sure exactly too if you guys are playing Pokemon Go today because I know the the event with the elemental monkeys there and uh, the Cotney, the Flabebe, that expires tonight for me. I don't know what time, but I was hoping to get in a few more checks to see if I can get something. I never got Pan Poor or Pan Seer. I only got a Pan Sage shiny. And the problem is, is that I got three of them last year. So for me, it's just an extra. <laughs> it's just an extra. But somebody is going to be really nice. There's a, I have a big Pokemon Go group, like a community where I live. And I went lucky with uh, a gentleman's wife. And he's going to be giving me a, a shiny Kecleon, which is really cool because he says he doesn't collect the shinies. So that's really awesome. I need that for my shiny living decks in the game. And he just wants a normal legendary in return. So I thought that was sick. <laughs> extra, extra, I hear all about it. <laughs> I think I'm gonna start bringing back memes to the channel as well. I used to do memes. I'm gonna, I, I think I'm gonna start bringing some back because I found, I've got some really good ideas in my head. I got good ideas. Nothing going on here. As long as they're not like Gen Z. What are like Gen Z memes? I, I wouldn't know. <laughs> or would I? Am I just lying? To be honest, I honestly don't know. <laughs> hey, Fla Baby. I've seen some and they're very questionable, but like what do Gen Z memes revolve around? Is there like a particular subject, particular TV show movie? I I don't know. Okay. That's crazy. We had the algorithm going for about an hour. That's not bad. If you guys are, that's a shiny. That's a shiny gold duck. <laughs> yeah, I'm a hundred percent. That's a shiny gold duck. Yep. Boo. <laughs> You're not. You're not a belly Pokemon. That's actually a good shot though of Golduck. <laughs> I mean, eh. I've already got a thousand of these, so if anybody wants it, it's theirs. Oh, no quick ball. It does look Good. The red looks really good in this lighting. The red looks good. Do you have Pokemon online, Val? Oh my god. It's gonna be stubborn. It's gonna be stubborn. I need. I don't have it yet. I've been searching. Um, if you have Pokemon online, I can give it to you. Yeah. Ugh. Okay, uh, you know what? I will use a dive ball for this one. Shiny Oricorio! Oh my god, nice! What version were you doing again? Oh, there you go. Nice. Very good. Yeah, I've got like a billion of these, so I can definitely give it away. I'll give it away at the end of stream, though. At the end of stream, remember that. Oh, God. I hate them. 
I hate them. They're gonna run into us the whole time. Oh, you did all oh, the fire one. Isn't that black? That's really cool, man. So that would have been a random shiny. That's not boosted with Outbreak. Oh man, that, that would have been cool. I don't know if I have that one. I, I don't remember which one we got in Ultra Moon when we did SOS. I do not remember. See, my thing with Belly Bolt is we're really getting bad spawns for that for it right now. Diego, can I give you one egg? I don't do trades unfortunately right now since we're doing encounters, but I appreciate it. What's the egg? Or is it supposed to be a mystery? And these mines, the flabebes are so annoying. I generally give an egg to whoever I subscribe to. Oh, well, hey, if you subscribe to me, I appreciate it. It's definitely, definitely, definitely appreciate it. But the problem is, is that I, I I like to do encounters on stream, and then if I'm trading, you know, one person, then I got to trade a lot of people. I usually save my trades for the end of stream, because then we get to not waste time with our sandwiches, you know? So we can get all the max shiny odds we can. You don't know what's inside. Huh. Interesting. You don't know what's inside, but didn't you hatch... Or collect the Pokemon? <laughs> or is it just like Scarlet and Violet where you can just have like five <laughs> Pokemon and you just, it's like a roulette. You never know. Is it something like that? Verizian would be nice, but we got to think about something else too. Uh, would we do a Dynamax adventure after this or do we do another reset hunt? Because if we did another one, I thought Tortuga, is that, is Tortuga the second evolution or first? The, there's like a, the second evolution of that turtle that I really want. I'll help BP farm with you if you want. Um, sure, I mean, I think I can do it, but if you wanted to join, I, I think that we can make that work. Two, two guys first. Yeah, I want that second evolution, bro. That, that second evolution's sick. I, I need that, so maybe that'd be a cool hunt to do. I've done Metagross before, so I would maybe not do that. And I've done Cabalion, and I've done uh, Terrakion. Oops. Oh no, 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 get away, nice. Jump over the creek. Does the yellow in with the belly bolt, does that yellow center go away or what? <laughs> it looks kind of like glowy. Oh my God. See that? It's like glitching out. This game is just the best Pokemon game performance wise ever created. I'm, I'm interested to see the shiny. This will be cool. This will be really cool. We have 17 minutes left. I don't know why I felt like we just got that. See what I mean though? They're very casual. They're 
for an outbreak, this really isn't an outbreak. Game of the year? Oh, dude, it should be game of the decade. And they should come out with like a really good copy of not the one with the, all the updates because they, you know, <laughs> they came out with a perfect game right off the bat and didn't need to update it, but they should come out with that copy and just release to everybody free of charge. Or you know what? It's so good, I would charge maybe full price. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> That's funny. Oh, it's nighttime. That would have been good for Umbreon, but whatever. <laughs> Maybe nighttime will change the spawns and we'll get more bellies and bolts. Another Oricorio? How many are you going for, bro? Barizian. That's sick. Okay. One more after this one because I'll have, oh, right. Nice. I, I thought you would have to outbreak all the different forms. I didn't know that you could do them all at once. That's sick. Oh yeah, nighttime made it like worse. <laughs> Do they, do they, they don't spawn on this half, do they? No. I just don't get why we're getting like no spawns. You need a flower to change its form? Oh, okay. So realistically, you could just get like one fire type or a curio, four shinies, and get the flower and it changes. That's that's smart, man. I never would have thought about that. I would have just hunted them all as like it's their forms. If we're only getting like two spawns, I'm not interested in continuing Belly Bolt, to be honest. <laughs> this, that's like such a waste of time. Oh, there we go. They're, they're spawning on like this half. Yeah, I, I think there's just so much other, like, options with Flabebe. Oh yeah, this half seems a lot better. There's so many other options with, like, Golduck, Flabebe, that I think it's, like, blocking out some of the spawns. Do I have the Shiny Charm? I do, yeah. I do. So the odds are, like, relatively really good for a Belly Bolt right now. You should put it on. Is that, like, a burn on me? <laughs> it oh it it's apparently on it it doesn't turn off but uh you, sometimes you think it does like look at all the flabebe and how many do you think are probably shiny that we pass a lot of them but again it's such a dumb shiny unless you see like unless you have like supervision and are seeking out the eyes. You, you won't know. You'll never know. For me, you know what's funny? It was like, um, it was like, uh, what's that deer, deerling. I didn't know what shiny that looked like because apparently people said it was just the fur changed, but I didn't realize that it had like a pink bow on its head. Man, you wanna know how many I've passed probably too? You're chasing an escaped cat. 
An uncivilized cat. This deer, the, <laughs> the, the Verizian is probably like so mad. It's like, bro, like, you're not gonna, it's, it's not gonna shine, man. <laughs> I'm not gonna shine for you. We should know better. We should know better. We should know better not to do it anymore. It's not gonna shine for us. Since I, like, I've, I've done this hunt over time as well. I think we've done maybe a couple hundred uh, resets into this. But I'm not, with reset hunts when you have another game going, it's not so bad. If you were reset hunting and that's all you were doing, oh man, that could get really boring. It, it's happened to us before. But like when you, when we're playing a different game like this, I feel like we have a lot of variety. And then even if you're like looking at the screen and you're just hoping for something, you have two options. We got Scarlet. Oh, I guess we got Violet and we got Sword. Too bad this belly bolt though is just <sighs> the spawns are so weird. They're abnormal. Oh, the flamingo almost caught in our way. Okay, you know what I'm kind of excited for, and I might, 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 might do. So when we do the, this is the thing I don't know what I would have to do. So if I did all the the Pokemon hunts again, they would be actually excluding the legendaries because with Shiny Charm, I wouldn't be able to do Articuno, Zapdos, Mewtwo, or Moltres. I've already done them. And it's funny, I've actually already done them in my other games as well. And uh, let's go Pikachu. I think my friend actually still has his version. I'm wondering if I could buy it off him. Because I, I don't have Let's Go Pikachu, I have just Let's Go Eevee. If I can get Let's Go Pikachu, that'd be hype. And then we could run like two Let's Go's at once. Woo! That sounds sick. Try, yeah. I'm gonna. I'll message him tonight. I'll message him tonight. We kind of bought it around the same time. Sounds very entertaining. Two, two. Let's goes. Like, don't get me wrong. Let's go. You're just sitting there and you're waiting and you're basically just like talking with chat. But like, this has all the premise of being really cool. <laughs> Tell me when you want a BP farm. Sure. You know what? It's almost that hour and a half into into stream. Let me check with my work schedule quick. I gotta I gotta check and see if they haven't added anything. Because if they haven't added anything, maybe I could do another hour or half an hour. Means I get to bully you. Yeah, you can bully me a little bit. Call me old man, yeah. <laughs> you get an extra half an hour of it maybe, yeah. On the weekend, I can kind of go back to like two hour streams. Because then I won't have obligations. 
I'm going to be seeing somebody on the weekend, maybe. So, uh, nighttime stream would still be fine. Nighttime stream would be okay. That's the thing. If I if I hit my phone though, ugh, then I'm gonna have to stop shiny hunting. I'll check in nine minutes. I don't have a long work day tomorrow. That's that's the reason why. If like. If nothing changed, I could stay up a little longer, but we'll have to see. I just don't want to waste our sandwich time right now. I want my main account back so I can try to stream, but I have to wait for my computer to come back. Honestly, I've gotten a few people who will message me on um, Discord, and they always ask... And I'm always down to give advice. Uh, I I know two people that have streamed because of the advice and they're doing really well. So if you need help, let me know. I, I have like a very basic uh, Mac and I, I can stream normally. <laughs> I, I really don't have an issue. Do you have a Discord? Yeah, so just type in exclamation Discord into the chat. And it should give you a link to the, to our Discord. If it doesn't work, let me know if you want to join. And I'll create a custom one for you. The Discord's getting more active. The, the busier streams get, the more subscribers we get, the more people that join, the more friends you can make while I'm not streaming. We have cool channels. And the more we grow, the more channels I can get. But yeah, like I said, uh, I'll, I'll do like a, I might start doing like a weekly analytics post. So then I could share what's going on with the, with the stream. Because like right now we're, I think we're still over a hundred subscribers plus in 28 days so that's that's pretty good we've been like that for at least a month i know that so again thank you for anybody that's subscribed or, or is listening and wants to it definitely i love seeing it every time like i check youtube studio app all the time whenever i see numbers go up i get happy <laughs> i'm like addicted to checking it all the time I don't know for sure, but the way things are going, I even think the last short video I did has a chance to hit 10K views. Oh, you got a ditto outbreak. I didn't even know that was possible. I didn't know that was possible. But I'll tell you this, um, for the next stream, I'm thinking this wasn't that bad, the Verizian. I kind of want to, I want to see it through now. I want to see the Verizian through. I want to get Verizian and we'll stick with Scarlet again. If we don't stick with Scarlet, I'm going to throw on Let's Go. But two Let's Go games at once would be so sick. Oh, you see, your luck's really good. Are you using a level one sandwich like I am with the cafeteria or are you using like a level three? But congrats, that's awesome. No, level three fire. Aha, uh -huh. there you go. Nice. See, level one for me, it's just never... This and level two, I've never really had a problem with. Level three is really good, but 
a lot of the times you you all are very generous to me and will give me the the sandwiches for stream because I just never have the time to do the raids. But uh, I mean, I'm always grateful for those as well. I still find it funny how mind blown you were. You found out I was AJ. I know the the problem is is that I, I when people change their names too much, it's you kind of have to like memorize stuff. And with our chat going crazier now than it was before, me trying to remember everything is getting harder. <laughs> And especially when your names, like, don't match from Discord to to YouTube here, you basically could be anybody. <laughs> I'm just going to keep calling you Antonio now. No more AJ. You are now known as Antonio. AJ has been, I don't know, sacrificed. You are now known as Antonio, or I'll call you AR for your name. Antonio Robinson, I'll just call you AR. AJ has been sacrificed. The name is no more. I guess on Discord it is. <laughs> Rest in peace, AJ, exactly. Do cats count as fan art? I mean, if you draw a cat, I guess so. But we have an art section. I don't think it's specific to like Pokemon. It's just like drawing, right? Just general art. You can just pop it in there. Are you going to blow up your washing machine now? Um, no, not yet. That's going to be, uh, that's going to be a special stream. <laughs> that's going to be a special stream. Is that, is that shiny? I think that's a shiny weasel. I'm going to save. Yeah, bro. I think that is. Yeah. I thought that was going to be a lot more gold in this game. This... That's interesting. That is a shiny. I thought that was going to be way more gold. Yo, what's up, Totodal? Happy! What's your favorite Pokemon? We caught it. Um, Mewtwo. That's my favorite. And people are going to give me crap because I'm a Gen 1-er. But let's just say I don't like anything in Gen 1. Gen 1 is dead to me. It never existed. I hate it. Um... <sighs> I would say Incineroar, <laughs> or, 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 um, I don't know why, but I'm really into the, I, and I always forget his name, the Sabertooth Tiger mythical in this game, Mianchao, is that it, is that it? I really like that. So it'd be Incineroar. Let's just say Incineroar never existed. It'd be Mianchao. You have four... T yeah, just anything that you want to send. If it's like general artwork, just throw it in the... Throw it in the channels. We, we kind of just try to keep organized. So, you know, there's not like a hundred conversations that are happening on like a bunch of, or a hundred conversations on the general. But yeah, throw any artwork you want. It doesn't have to be Pokemon related. Just put in that general art. And then if you just want to discuss something, uh, general's cool. 
if you want to talk about art, you don't have to limit it to um, just throwing up a picture for art. Chen Pao? Is it Chen Pao? It could be. I, I honestly don't remember. But I really like that shiny. I kind of like the fusion too with the the Calyrex and I, I've probably butchered that name. Calyrex and Spectrier. I really like that fusion. I think that's really cool. It looks more like a Digimon to me than a Pokemon, but like whatever. It is what it is. Oh, I totally forgot about my other Switch. My bad. What channel is for cats and pictures? Do we not have a pets one? Uh, to be honest, I I should know my own Discord better. <laughs> You're going to have to to just look around the channels that we have and, and see what's up. I'll I'll check my own. I'll check for my own knowledge. <laughs> The Necrozma and Lunala Fusion. Um, yes, I do know it. I don't know why I'm blanking on it right now, but I do know it. Man, imagine Mega Solgaleo and Mega Lunala. Mind blown. They're already big, but that'd be sick. I don't have a pets one. Um, I will get off stream, um, kind of make my food, and when I'm kind of casually eating, I'll make a pet se section. I think we had it before. So if we have pages like that, where it's like the side threads, and not a lot of people kind of use them, I'll delete them. So maybe, I, I felt like we did, but... Yeah, maybe maybe just nobody used them and I deleted it. But I'll I'll add it back. Or, you know, since not a lot of people do it, just throw it up in the general. If I decide that I want to do it as a channel page or like a channel side thing there, I'll let you know, but you can just do it wherever you want. You have the soul rights. See, I'll be honest, and this is gonna this is gonna make you cringe a bit, but I am more of a dog person than I am a cat. And my dad's dogs unfortunately died um, in November, I think, or December, one of the two. Like literally a month apart, which sucks. So I was helping him going over some humane societies and seeing if he liked any of the dogs and it makes me want to get a dog. <laughs> it really does. I really want a dog. But I, I don't, my, my schedule is so bad that it wouldn't be fair to a dog to, to live with me. You own a blind dog? See, there was a dog that was on the Humane Society and it didn't have one eye. And those are the type of dogs that my dad loves. The ones that nobody would usually go for. Which is really awesome because I'm kind of like the same way. But the problem with me is is that like... I'm, so, I'm financially stable for my life now. But if I were to add a dog to the mix... I would be... I, I do myself right now pretty well, but if I added another living creature to my household, I I wouldn't be able to give it the best life it deserves. Because I like to travel, right? I go out a lot and I, I live by myself, right? So in my apartment, I, I can't really, I can't really control a dog and it'd be alone for like eight to 12 hours a day because that's my work schedule. It's just, it's not fair to a dog. Cats, I know, are kind of their own different thing. They can, 
they could fill up their own day, but I think dogs are just one of those things that are are harder on them to be alone than cats. Seven rabbits. Whoa. Do the cats ever go at the rabbits or what? But my dad's going to get a small dog, I think. I think so. Like, my dad's relatively older, right? So he he wants a dog that's a couple years old, trained, so he doesn't have to go through what my other dogs were. They weren't necessarily so trained to go on, like, pee pads and stuff, so they'd, like, always miss. And they weren't, like, really nice to other dogs because they were in, like you know, the shelter for so long, but he just wants dogs that are going to be um, a little bit more, they have self-control a little bit more. I thought yesterday, or was it today? Maybe it was today. I thought about like getting a fish, <laughs> but I, I'm also in that position where what happens if I get a fish and uh, like I'm not there in home in time, right? To feed it again, even if it's a fish, I want to give anything that I have the best quality of life, right? I heard there's like auto feeders, but but then what's the point of having like a fish that only lasts for <laughs> like a couple months or whatever, right? I don't, I'm sure you can get more fish that have better average lifespans, but I mean, yeah, like I'm not getting like an aquarium. I'm going to get more of like a bowl, but a good bowl where it can swim around and stuff, right? And thank you for the six likes, by the way, everybody. Thank you. Thank you. I don't know. I'm going to look into fish because I... Not that I need something, but I don't know. It'd be kind of cool to come home to a fish and just, you know, chill. <laughs> I could have like an aquarium. I, if I got an aquarium, I'd put it in the back where you guys could see it on stream. <laughs> That'd be sick. And we can name them all like Pokemon and then like... <laughs> for a membership perk, you can name name a fish and I'll add it. Oh, that'd be so cool, actually. That'd be really cool. Add, like, a member perk where if you become a member, I'll get, like, a goldfish or whatever. Or I'll get some sort of fish and I'll add it to the tank. And then that's how many members we have. That's sick. Name the fish Greg. <laughs> for sure. Why not? You can do the BP while you shiny hunt. Oh, I, I appreciate that. But you know what? Here, I think the shiny sandwich is done. Uh, which game are we in? Here, let me just check. Um, okay, I'm going to check my, my schedule now to see if I can go longer. Because if I can't, this is going to be the time I got to get off. Yeah, okay. This is the time I'll have to get off. They added more. <laughs> Which, if that's the case, tomorrow I can stream, though. That's that's a guarantee. You can see me tomorrow night. But I'll do one more reset after this. Thank you all for watching the stream. Yeah, unfortunately, my, my schedule, I gotta... I'll still have another hour of things I gotta do. And I got to be up early in the morning. But I'm going to... One of the things I'm going to do tonight is make sure I upload uh, a video. So at, right after stream, maybe within 10 to 20 minutes, I'll, I'll have a video up for everybody. And it'll be the Alola version with Ultra, Ultra Beasts and Ultra Beast Balls. <laughs> I'm kidding. With Beast Balls. 
And it's a cool little adventure. I don't remember if I got all the eight gym leaders done in that mini game, but yeah, there'll be stuff for you to watch. And then eventually with the Discord, I want to, st I don't know how people do it, but whenever a video is uploaded, you can get a notification on Discord too. I want to somehow get that for our Discord. But here, 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 I promised a trade today. Who did I promise a trade to again today? Was it you, Ashton? I'll do the trade as promised. We'll do this quick. Uh, who did I promise? Oh, it was Val, right? Is Val still here? Is Val still here? If Val's not here, I'll save the, the gold duck for her. But yes, thank you so much everybody for hanging out with me again tonight. The streams are going to get a little bit longer on the weekend. Trust me. We'll, we'll make it happen. And I might even do like a shiny challenge. So I'll, I'll come up with something fun for us to all do together. And join me in the fun. If you're here in the future, I hope everybody liked seeing two Switch consoles go at the same time. I enjoyed it. We didn't waste a lot of time with the encounters. So in between, I think... We could do this again. We'll add let's go into the mix, this and that. I think the setup's pretty good and everybody likes the layout. I think it looks good. It looks fine for me, but let me know in the comments. Thank you for the likes. Thank you for the new subscriptions, everybody. I will see you tomorrow. We'll do one more check here since we're already here. If it's shiny, I quit streaming. Oh, okay, I don't have to quit. All right.